a warm good morning my dear students today we shall proceed in the chapter 4 atomic structure in the class of day before yesterday we have done up to here comparison between dalton's atomic theory and modern atomic theory today we will proceed about its structure now we know that an any atom except protium one isotope of hydrogen so <coughs> an atom is made up of three subatomic particles what is subatomic particles modern theories about the subatomic particles include existing over इतना है आज की तारीख में बाबू वी आर नोइंग 200 हंड्रेड सब एटोमिक पार्टिकल्स सो फार वी आर नोइंग कि एन एटम इज मेड अप ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉन प्रोटॉन्स एंड न्यूट्रॉन्स इट इज नॉट सो वेन यू विल गो इन हायर क्लासेस हायर क्लासेस मीन्स नॉट इन टेन इन एलेवन ट्वेल्व यू विल फाइंड देर आर 10, 11, 11 subatomic particles after uh, electron, proton, and neutron. But in fact, there are c exist of over 200 subatomic particles. There are more than 200 subatomic particles like electron, proton, and neutrons. No worry. We have to do nothing with. those protein protein or neutrons we have to do nothing we have to deal here with only an atom it is made up of number of subatomic particles but the three subatomic particles they are of great importance electron proton and neutrons for understanding the structure of an atom ki proton and neutrons are at the central part of an atom they are located situated at the nucleus while electrons revolve around the nucleus in circular <coughs> path <coughs> these things we have we have seen earlier ki electron its symbol is this means it has minus 1 negative charge its mass is almost zero or we can write like this this hydrogen it is hydrogen hydrogen has one atomic number and one mass number or this is also called proton we can write like this ki it if this hydrogen सी बाबू दिस इज योर हाइड्रोजन इफ दिस हाइड्रोजन हैज वन इलेक्ट्रॉन एंड वन प्रोटोन एट द न्यूक्लियर सो दिस हाइड्रोजन हैज ओनली टू थिंग्स वन इलेक्ट्रॉन एंड वन प्रोटोन इफ इट लूज वन इलेक्ट्रॉन इट विल बी लेफ्ट विथ ओनली वन प्रोटोन so this is called hydrogen ion or proton so here in fact i had used the term hydrogen this is the isotope of hydrogen but in fact this is not hydrogen it is hydrogen ion it is only hydrogen ion having one positive charge one atomic number and one mass number it has no neutron or we can write like this here is charge on electron it is minus 1 unit negative charge in proton one positive unit charge and neutron has no charge here is the mass number an electron is 1 by 1840 in fact it is 1 by 183 times or 37 times less than mass of one 
हाइड्रोजन आइटम यहाँ जो दिया हुआ है कि इट इज वन बाई वन एट फोर जीरो द फैक्ट इज दैट इट इज वन एट थ्री सेवन जीरो द मास ऑफ वन हाइड्रोजन आइटम इज कंसिडर्ड टू बी वन ए एम यू मास ऑफ प्रोटोन इज ऑलमोस्ट वन ए एम यू दे आर ऑल्सो ऑलमोस्ट ए एम यू न्यूट्रॉन इज स्लाइटली वेरी वेरी एंड वेरी स्लाइटली ग्रेटर देन प्रोटोन बट दे आर कंसिडर टू बी वन ए एम यू वी हैड स्टडीड एन एटम हैज ओनली टू थिंग्स टू पार्ट वन इज योर न्यूक्लियस अनदर योर ऑर्बिट्स देर आर टू स्ट्रक्चरल पार्ट ऑफ एन एटम फर्स्ट वन इज न्यूक्लियस एंड द एम्प्टी स्पेस इन विच देर आर ऑर्बिट्स दिस ऑर्बिट्स आर एन इमेजनरी पार्ट दे आर इमेजनरी पार्ट in which the electrons revolve they are called orbits one thing the protons and neutrons the protons and neutrons present in the nucleus they are also called as nucleons so what is nucleons the subatomic particles present in the central part Are nucleus. The what are the particles present in the nucleus? Obviously, protons and neutrons. Orbit is what many times we have is discussed. The orbit or cell or energy level, they are the imaginary path in which the electron revolve around the nucleus with high speed, one tenth of speed of light. Now atomic number. What is atomic number? At an atom, any element, they have its own characteristic number, which differences, distinguishes it from the atom of another element. It means no two, no two or more atoms will have same number of protons. All the atoms have different numbers of uh, protons. Due to this different number of protons, means they have different atomic number. So, due to different atomic number, an atom different from the another atom, or one element differ from the another element. <coughs> this characteristic number of protons. they are called atomic number so what is atomic number number of protons present in the nucleus are called atomic number an atom is electrically neutral why because number of proton is equals to the number of electrons so the atomic number is therefore it is equal to the number of electron present in an atom so why an atom is electrically neutral many times we have studied because they have same number of protons and same number of electrons they are equal in charge these protons are positively charged and electrons are negatively charged and a nucleus the nucleus of an atom is positively charged why because number of proton gives the total positive charge in the nucleus they are present only in the nucleus so here is the summary the protons present the atomic number of an element is the number of protons present in the nucleus number of protons present in the nucleus are called atomic number atomic number of an element ye hai or number of electrons present in an atom it is also correct or number of positive charge number of positive charge means obviously proton
present in the nucleus are called atomic number <coughs> then mass number mass number is what so far now we are knowing that an atom is made up of electron proton and neutrons electron revolve around the nucleus in the orbit but the protons and neutrons are present in the nucleus so number of protons not number of protons only sum of if it is hydro oxygen there are eight protons and eight neutrons so the sum of these two what will be the sum 8 plus 8 16 so this 16 sum of the protons and neutrons are called mass number mass number is denoted by a and atomic number is denoted by z don't be confused that a for atomic number no here a is for mass number and z is for atomic number we will never write a small a for mass number this will be wrong this will be capital so mass number it is the sum of number of protons and neutrons present in the nucleus and it is denoted by a now mass number how is however it is whole number it is approximation of atomic mass see we should know what is atomic mass if it is one atom of oxygen this is oxygen one atom of oxygen what they have eight protons eight neutrons and eight electrons mass of one proton is supposed to be one amu means mass of eight protons will be eight amu neutrons 8 amu and mass of electron is considered to be zero so it will be zero so there are only three subatomic particles if we add the mass of three these three these three subatomic particles that will be the mass of the atom so it comes to 16 amu so 16 is the atomic mass of oxygen so number of protons sum of number of protons is called mass number and the whatsoever will be the mass number mass number has no unit but then that number that mass number if it is 16 that 16 will be the atomic mass of that element now one important thing is here we will see on it will come later on see today i am giving you one thing isotopes what is isotopes isotopes you will see it on page number 64 page number 64 don't think that i am skipping these pages don't think so we will come back to these pages also what is isotopes here is one atom one element hydrogen it has three forms in one form they have one proton and zero neutron it is called protium in another form it has one proton and one neutron it is called deuterium in the third form it has one proton 
and two neutrons it will be tritium now we have studied in even class 7 and 8 here will be the name of atom here or element whatsoever you want to say in the bottom of the left we write atomic number and at the top here or even here we can write like oxygen atomic number atomic number is your 8 and atomic number is your 16 this place is fixed for atomic number but this mass number can be written here also right so here is the protium having one atomic number and one mass number this hydrogen has one atomic number two mass number one atomic number and three mass number now here i have written the definition of the isotopes but you can study it what is they all are the isotopes they all are different items of same element so what is isotope different items of same element having same atomic number but different mass number are called isotopes here is another atom i am giving you example of oxygen in book you will find only two but i am giving you three in fact there are three isotopes oxygen in one kind one isotope it has eight protons eight neutrons so its atomic number will be 8 mass number will be 16 and here 8 protons and 9 neutrons so atomic number will be same 8 but mass number will be 17 in the third case atomic number will be 8 but mass number will be 18 so they all are the different atoms of oxygen having same atomic number 8 but different mass number so if we see my dear friends all the isotopes of hydrogen or oxygen or carbon or any isotopes why do they differ they differ only due to the number of neutrons they differ only due to the number of neutrons why because number of protons and number of electrons are same but they differ only in the number of neutrons there should be no confusion then there are some properties here are some examples i had given you now you can see it what are the properties what are the properties of an isotopes and use of isotopes see isotopes they have same chemical properties if you can see any here are in fact no isotopes they have same same to same chemical properties why same chemical properties for example due to same atomic number for this isotope of hydro oxygen Configuration will be 2, 6. For this oxygen atom, configuration will be this. For this will be 2, 6. Due to same electronic configuration, they have same chemical properties. They differ only in mass number. Now, though they have the same chemical properties, but they differ in physical properties we will see isotopes have same atomic number means same number of protons and same number of <coughs> electrons and same electronic configuration so chemical properties are determined by the electronic configuration so isotope of an element are chemically identical chlorine has also two isotopes in one case Atomic number is 17 undoubtedly, but mass number is 35 or and 37. 
they have the same chemical properties but they differ in physical properties for example generally what we know if uh, if mass is greater or if greater is the mass more will be the density and if density is more its boiling point will be more melting point will be more likewise this oxygen has more mass will have more density will have more melting point will have more boiling point for this it has less least mass it has greater mass this has the greatest mass among these three so it will have less density greater than this one this will have greater density and this one will have greater density than this one it will have more melting or boiling point than this deuterium this is tritium this is deuterium and this will have more boiling point more density than protein so physical property they differ isotopes differ in physical properties like density and boiling point so physical constant like physical property depends on atomic mass just right now i have told you atomic mass is what mass of an atom and what are the mass of a electron uh, sorry electron mass is considered to be zero whatsoever will be the mass of proton and mass of neutron the sum of their numbers sum of their numbers i think i have used just one sentence before um, i'm confused that what term i had used once again i'm telling you what is atomic mass mass of an atom i had explained to the mass of an electron is considered to be zero so what will be the number of neutrons and proton one proton has one atomic mass one unit mass and one neutron has one atomic mass one amu one atomic mass unit if they have eight protons then eight amu and if have nine proton uh, neutrons will be nine amu so eight plus nine it will be seventeen amu so a mass number will be seventeen and atomic mass will be 17 amu because mass of electron is considered to be negligible or zero so for example boiling point of protium is this much 20.38 but deuterium is 23.5 why because it has greater mass i had told you I had used the term greater is the mass here the same thing higher is the mass of isotope higher will be the greater will be the melting or boiling point they are radioactive substance tetratium or carbon 14 they differ, they differ in physical property they are the isotopes we will see when we will go back in the next class then what are the properties isotopes of cobalt it is used in radiotherapy for the treatment of cancer c14 c14 means carbon whose atomic number is this and mass number is this they are there are three isotopes will have same atomic number mass number will be 12 13 and 14 14 one is used for the determining the determining the age of histological and geological material they are used for this an isotope of uranium there are two isotopes 232 235 sorry students it will be 238 i think i am Hi, it will be 238 this one is used as fuel in nuclear power plants 
isotopes of iodine it has two isotopes 130 and 131 this 130 and is used for the treatment of goiter what is goiter many of you might have seen some swelling in the throats of the persons extra throats just like potato or something like bigger size swelling is there that disease is called goiter for the treatment of this goiter disease that isotopes are used what isotope of iodine and which one whose mass number is 131 here this radioactive isotopes what is radioactive substance in short i am telling you the elements the metals on it is not only metals it might be also non metals many non metals are also isotopes but mainly most of the metals are radioactive substance radioactive substance they emits alpha rays beta rays and gamma rays you will study in details about the emission of alpha beta and gamma rays in physics in class 10 chapter 11 no 11 in chapter 12 modern physics they are used isotopes radioactive isotopes are used in industry to find out if there is any leakage in the underground pipes or gas pipe or water pipes so so my dear students it is enough for today i am giving you the homework at the same time you have to finish the chapter this is 4c you will write down the question answer of 4b wish you all the best we will meet on the next class bye